Hey, Professor Jordan. Hope all is well. Uh, it's Brian Biggs back here again, and I am talking today about the hardest sport to play, which is easily, no doubt, soccer. You know, soccer has a 90-minute game, two 45-minute halves, and it actually leads in percentage uh, in statistics. It leads in percentage of actual activity uh, during the game. Uh, compared to football games that might be three and a half hours, but you only play like 20 plays, 30 plays, you know, maybe 50. And so there's just not a lot of time when you're actually on the field. And for me, that's what already sets soccer apart is, wow, you got to do a lot more running than you think, you know. Um, also, while running and doing all this and in this incredibly long span, you need to understand how to do things with your feet and have the right coordination of how to change speeds with the ball, how to run, change directions, you know. That, all that stuff with your feet. Not with your hands, with your feet. That's impossible. So for me, that's what kind of makes soccer the hardest sport. Uh, just due to that sheer amount of control that people need to have with their feet. Because for me personally, I play basketball, I play football, I play baseball, I play things with my hands. You know, I always talk coordination with my hands. The feet's a different ball game. That's just a whole different, that's not even, we're not even on the same part of the body. I'm up here, they're down there, you know. So for me, that's what just what makes soccer so beautiful and so ridiculously hard to play. Because uh, I could never get my feet to do anything like that if I tried, if I tried. Um, but some other sports that are also very difficult to play um, are baseball, football, and golf. Those three are pretty tough. Football, obviously, because you got to be big, strong, fast, athletic. But you know, soccer is the opposite. You got to be small. You got to be quick. You got to be—it's the complete opposite. So for me, that's that just shakes things up, you know. And you don't have to run that long. You get a bunch of breaks. Uh, baseball, same thing. You get a bunch of breaks. You get a bunch of time where you're just not playing. You know, you're waiting. Um, and then with golf. Uh, you don't have a defender, you know, and I think that that's like why people love golf, but still, I think that doesn't put as much pressure on. So if someone thinks that you know soccer's that easy or they can just go do that, please go to any field with a goal and just try to shoot the ball on target from that 18-yard box, the big box they got. Just shoot it from out there, and then let me know how you do. Thank you very much. Uh, hope you have a good one. Bye.